If you're ever on a job site and you cannot discover your Eclipse controllers using Express Network Utility, it could be because um, there's a router in between your connection and where the controllers are connected that will not forward the broadcast packet that we use for discovery in that tool. Um, there's a little bit of a workaround. Uh, you can use our new Eclipse network, which is currently in beta, um, to discover your controllers and create an Express Network Utility export. Um, that way you can import, refresh, and manage your devices, and hopefully that will make sense here in a second. Um, so drag and drop the Eclipse network from uh, the DC Eclipse module, which will get installed as part of the beta installer and eventually uh, likely the uh, support pack installation. Uh, make sure under the network you go into the uh, device policy, go into the default device policy and put in your credentials for your Eclipse controllers. Um, then go to the main network and hit discover. Uh, put in your starting IP address. If these are brand new Eclipse controllers out of the box and there is no uh, router installed or no DHCP server rather, uh, then put in a 169.254.0.0 uh, as your starting address with a 255.255.0.0 uh, subnet mask. Um, then hit OK. Uh, that's going to initiate your discovery. This is going to use an IP scan technique rather than uh, the MDNS packet that Express Network Utility uses. Uh, so this should work across routers. Uh, then you can add these devices to your network. And then once they're added, uh, you can do your Export Express, choose a spot to save it, I'm going to put it in my desktop, hit OK, and you'll see that you get a CSV file that includes the devices, their IP address, and their MAC address. So now I can open up Express Network Utility. I can do a file import and point to that CSV file. And then I can right click and refresh all items, put in my credentials. And now uh, Express Network Utility will know the IP addresses, so the discovery mechanism is out of the loop here. And, uh, and once I authenticate, I can manage these devices business as usual.